how could liquids swallowed into the digestive tracts end up in the bladder? The other confusing thing about this is that urine has around six different bacterial species on average, whereas the gut can house up to a thousand. So for our forbidden golden rainbow to blossom, the liquids that we swallow into our stomach and our intestines need to be absorbed by an intermediary, the blood. Now the blood is usually sterile, so the intestines have a particularly efficient way of allowing the fluids to seep through without the bacteria. Once this fluid is in the blood, it makes its way around the body to eventually reach the nephron in the kidney where it is pushed out and filtered depending on how much hydration we have. We can then even adjust the composition of urine with absorption depending on how much sodium and things like potassium that we need to keep in our body. So the normal human has in fact no direct connection from the gut to the blood.